How's it going everyone? Welcome to Path to Wellness. Today's video is a 15 minute total body hotel room workout. There are no excuses. So if you're not yet subscribed, please click the subscribe button and check the bell so you're notified of my new videos. All right, so this is gonna be five moves and three rounds. Each move is 40 seconds of work and 20 seconds of rest. First move is these little mini jump squats. So of course you can adjust the time that you work and you rest depending on your current ability. But in this workout video, I'm doing 40 seconds of work and 20 seconds of rest. So I um, wanted to mention one other thing. I'm also doing fat loss and fitness coaching and motivation. So if you're interested, just send me an email. My email is in the description box below. It's rippedandhealthy365 at gmail.com. Thanks a lot. All right, so first move, 40 seconds, and then 20 seconds of rest. Second move, I'm going to be doing some various push-ups, 40 seconds. And then after the push-ups, it's going to be 20 seconds of rest. So for this example, you're, of course, you're not going to need any equipment. You can do this workout anywhere, and it's a great way to get a full body workout in 15 minutes. And I was doing several close grip push-ups, close hand push-ups, then I was doing standard push-ups, and then I was doing wide push-ups. Get the full range there. So you can do as many rounds of this as you want. If you only have five minutes for a workout, just do one round. That's a five minute total body workout. If you got 10 minutes, you could do two rounds. So in this workout, I was gonna do three rounds for a total of 15 minutes, but you could always go 20 minutes if you wanna do four rounds. All right, so that was the second move was the push-ups, taking a 20 second break, and we're going straight into jump squats. Now with all of these moves, you can modify, of course. So if you can't do push-ups, like let's say you can't do regular push-ups, you can always do push-ups on your knees and work your way up. And then if doing 40 seconds of work and 20 seconds of rest is too much, you could start out with the opposite. You could do 20 seconds of work and 40 seconds of rest, work your way to 30 seconds and then to 40 seconds and go from there. And again, with these jumps, with these jump squats, um, if you want less impact, you can just do walking squats instead of jumping. But of course, when you're jumping, you're going to get the heart rate really going. And this is like a cardio, upper body, lower body, really great workout you can do in a very short amount of time. You definitely don't need any equipment to get a great workout. So don't let that, don't let time or money or equipment ever stop you. All right, so we're on the third move and I'm doing these mountain climbers. Again, we're doing 40 seconds of work with 20 seconds of rest. So some things I like to do to stay in great shape and good health, I incorporate daily intermittent fasting. Uh, that's daily intermittent fasting with mostly a plant-based diet and exercise regularly as well. So I'm still mainly doing the two meal a day routine. So I'm fasting in the morning, uh, do my workout generally at midday, um, have a meal at 1.30, and then have a second meal after dinner at, at around 6.30. All right, four moves down, one move to go. Quick 20-second break, catch the breath. I know those mountain climbers are tough, especially at this point in the workout. So lastly, it's the good old burpee. One of the best moves you can do. Great for cardio, great for strength. So that's about it. So again, you can do this two times, you can go through it three times, four times, as much time, as much energy as you have you want to put forward in the workout. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.